There's a peaceful quality to the home. It has this kind of soft, almost immersive feeling as if you're sitting in the garden. My name's Andrew Ben, and I'm the founding director of Ben and Penner Architecture, and I've been the architect for this project in Taramara, Sydney. So Taramara is in the outer northern suburbs of Sydney. It's a particularly sort of garden-focused neighbourhood with some very charming heritage-listed houses. So the clients for this project were Sue and Andrew, a really wonderful couple that we got along tremendously well with. Sue particularly was very involved in the project and I'd say she's an unusually creative person. So she really was fundamentally involved in every aspect of what we did and together we achieved an incredible outcome because of it. My name's Sue and I am the client for this project, Taramara House. So I saw a beautiful set of townhouses that Andrew had designed in Belmain and I decided to reach out to him and the process began from there. In terms of the original home, we wanted to retain as much of it as we could and we wanted to highlight all the beautiful original features, the lead light windows and the gorgeous ceilings. And we wanted to give her a new lease of life without losing any of the beautiful character. So the brief Sue and Andrew had was really twofold. On, on the one hand, it was how to bring back the charm of the original old building, but on the other hand, how to adopt it to their modern family. So one particularly important aspect was how to connect the house to the garden. I mean, the garden had an incredible potential that wasn't utilised when I first saw it. So a key driver around the whole development was that fusion of the garden. So in the design, I wanted a really neutral palette. Lots of natural finishes, but with some drama as well. And then other material choices then fell in behind that idea. And they had very soft tones with low saturations. There have been so many benefits to adding the extension onto the back, but one of the unexpected things is the beautiful light and how it changes during the day. Whether it's in the morning and the light is coming in predominantly through the large skylight and from the east, or even late in the afternoon when we get the western sun. So light's a particularly important aspect of this project. It's predominantly coming from three different sources. The first of them being a small little pocket garden that separates the new additions from the original home. And then as the sun tracks across the sky, it comes in from the back rear facade that faces west. And then the third source of light is coming from this particularly large skylight that sits on the southern slope of the roof. So it's one that's sort of constantly dropping a very even source of light across the space throughout the day. My favourite detail in the project is this soaring arch. It's a direct reflection of the traditional Victorian arch that frames the front entry of the house. My favourite part is the new extension to the house. I love being in this space. I love walking down the stairs. I feel instantly calm. I feel so happy when my family are all in here eating and cooking and spilling out onto the terrace and down to the pool. 